A special ground report uh, from Meghalaya and it's a multi-cornered fight in Meghalaya. There are 10 candidates in the free, free and a lot at stake for multiple political parties where the BJP has backed out of the contest uh, to keep the NDA votes undivided. Of course, uh, uh, the bid is to keep Conrad Sangma's legacy alive but the TMC is also eyeing expansion beyond West Bengal. Can it trump the regional satraps? That's a big question. Take a look. Fifty-eight years old, Mazal Ampering Lingdo, once a Congress heavyweight in Meghalaya, is now a minister in the Conrad Sangma's government and the NPP candidate for the prestigious Shillong Lok Sabha seat. The BJP is supporting Ms. Lingdo, but the seat is with the Congress for three decades. Despite NDA's big victory in 2014 and 2019, and the congress being out of power in the state for the past 6 years the party has managed to hold on to its shillong bastion thank you mr three time shillong mp former union minister vincent pala is the last of congress heavyweights in the northeast there is no anti incumbency for the npp as far as mp is concerned however we as a political party are now way ahead in our service to the people today the people knows they have been exposed that every word to npp is a word to bjp i think i'm the only mp i'm the only politicians now so far have not been shaken by the bjp other mps you see be it in in arunachal be it in assam be it, many of them have gone away Why? Because they have been uh, viewed or they have been treated. Over 300 kilometers away from Shillong, <laughs> in the state's Garo Hills region, the home turf of Chief Minister Conrad Sangma, his party has fielded another woman, Conrad's sister and former Union Minister Agatha Sangma from the Tura constituency. Agatha is a sitting MP, and Tura is prestige battle for the Sangma. The seat has been with the family since the mid 70s. The two women candidates of NPP, Kor Shillong and Tura, are asking for votes in the name of the Modi Sangma double engine. This election is more about continuing on the path of development, and uh, I feel that because NPP has given such a uh, in these six years wonderful performance in its governance, it's a sign that uh, the team and uh, you know the entire. NPP is something that is accepted by the people. The contest for the two Lok Sabha seats in Christian-dominated Meghalaya is not a straightforward NDA versus India block fight. There are six candidates for the Shillong seat and four for the Tura seat, and regional players who have emerged as king makers in state polls have this time pitched in for the Lok Sabha polls as well. Outside Bengal, the TMC feels it has a small chance. in Meghalaya Tura where former minister Dennis Sangma has been fielded he is a heavyweight and former Hello. chief minister Mukul Sangma is campaigning hard for his younger brother attacking NPP and Agatha Sangma for supporting CAA she while campaigning gave the assurance that she would uh, object and uh, object the passing of CAB, the people of the region, the people of the state of Meghalaya and uh, this part of the state has been betrayed. The multi-cornered fight in the two seats of Meghalaya might turn crucial in NDA's pursuit to win more seats from the North East. Ratnadeep Chaudhary, Pandit TV.